Today, we're in the herd with men's basketball. The Bison have jumped out to a 2-1 start on the 2013-14 season, and head coach Dave Paulson says the second win of the year, the home opener against St. Francis on Saturday evening, wasn't perfect, but was very good nonetheless. Well, certainly there's things that we have to work on and improve upon, but you know, I like the way we shared the ball, I like the energy we had, but we did a pretty solid job defensively. It was fun to see uh, a better turnout from the student body than we've had in a while. Hopefully that will continue. We're not satisfied with the student body's performance either, but it's, it's much improved and it was a fun night, unveiled the banners, and then now we got to start getting ready for St. John's. Next up for Bucknell is three straight road games to tough venues, including Albany on Saturday and St. John's of the Big East Conference on Tuesday. Yeah, they're a good team, they're talented, they're athletic, and uh, you know, it's, it's, it's fun though. I'm, I'm looking forward to it getting in Carnesec Arena and you know, all the great players and great teams that have come through St. John's. Um, it, it's going to be exciting for, for me and for all our guys to get on the court against them. One player who finally had some shots fall was sophomore Chris Haas. Yeah, it was definitely nice to see them go in. Um, you know, my first four shots were both like, I mean, they're all like in and out. Probably was thinking about it just a little bit too much. But at the same time, I was like, just go out there and keep shooting. You know, coach always tells us to go out there and shoot and uh, especially look for your shot, especially the people that, um, that he wants at the perimeter, like me, Cam, and John, like, he got, like we have to make shots, and we have to be looking for our shots. And it was just great to see him go in. In the game against St. Francis, Haas also picked up a steal that led to a score. And while he's not known for his defense, he says he can still make some things happen. Coach always tells me to use my length. I mean, I'm not overly quick, and so he's always like, Chris, like, you don't have like, the edge on pretty much anyone you're going to be guarding. So, you know, just like keep those hands up, keep them wide, and just use your length on, on everything you have. You can listen to all the action of Tuesday night's game against the Red Storm beginning at 8 o'clock on BucknellBison.com, and you can also watch it on Fox Sports 1 beginning at tip-off at 8.30. For Saturday, the pregame will be 6.30 for the big game at Albany. And again, you can listen to all the action of that one on BucknellBison.com.